All right, JB, given that it's uh football Sunday, okay. my question is football related and it's right. more of a category question. Um, I think it's difficult to name any of these guys. All right. So I'm going to give you a, uh, kind of an allotment, uh, give me five of the top 20 interception leaders of all time. You can go passing yards. You want to. Interceptions. I told I told you this was a tough one. Oh my goodness. Interceptions. Um top five. I don't know if I'll even get one. Lester Hayes. Lester Hayes is not on the list. <laughs> Lester Hayes. Uh Ken Houston. This might be too hard of a question for the show because he's not on there either. I can't think of corner. Oh, um, Mel Blunt. Mel Blunt is on there at number 13, tied with uh, five <laughs> other number, players, by the way. <laughs> he's number 13? Yeah. I'm in trouble. I got two guys that didn't make the list. <laughs> number 13 is my highest. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I don't know this one. Um, let me think of D-backs. Ronnie Lott. Correct. He's tied for number eight with another player. Oh, so that's two of them. not top five. <laughs> <laughs> so I got a lot at eight. I bet you people are yelling at the screen right now saying, say this, say this. A lot harder when you get put on the spot. Very hard. Number one, I have no idea who these five are. The fir first hint I will give you, I'm, I'm not going to give you a team unless you get really stuck, but I will tell you that his career spanned from 2002 until 2013. Woodson? Ron Woodson? Um incorrect although ron woods rod woodson is on the list and he is number three all time wait so he and is on the list he is on the list but that's not the clue that i gave you because uh rod <laughs> woodson's uh career spanned from 1987 to 2003 okay so i got one so far i got woodson you got woodson in the top hey i was only asking for five out of the top 20 so as far as i'm concerned you got three right now because you got blunt Oh, okay. I thought you, you got Woodson and you got a lot. Yeah, okay. no, just think, five out of the 20. Who's the guy from the Eagles back in the day? Oh, my goodness. I can't remember his name. He's on there because you're laughing. <laughs> I can't remember his name. I don't remember his name. I, I, I'm going to give, oh. give you I'm going to give you one more hint. The okay. the last guy that you got, the he shares a name with another guy that's on the top 20. That's the best thing I could give you. Rod, so you got no. you got Rod, you got Rod Woodson, and then someone Aaron else. Aaron Woodson, ever? I don't, I don't know. Charles Woodson. Charles Woodson. Okay. All right. So he was ninety eight to two thousand fifteen. The hint that I gave you was for, um, and as soon as I say the team, you're probably going to know who it is. Uh, the Baltimore Ravens. Ed Ed uh, Reed. Ed Reed. Yeah, he's number eight. So. Do you want to try for one more? Because as far as I'm concerned, you got four. You want to try for one more out of the 20? See if you can think of anybody. Brian Dawkins, that's his name. It just hit. Yeah, that that's who I thought you were thinking about. And that's why I was laughing because he's not on the list. <laughs> Did all that work for nothing? <laughs> that was a lot of uh that was a lot of mental Olympics, as they would say. <laughs> Do you give up? Because I'll yeah, give you the, give the I'll top give you some. Five. Give me the top five. All right. Top five. Um at number five. Tied for number five with Charles Woodson is Ken Riley. Probably one of the coolest names ever. And actually, how they have him listed on the list is uh, Night Train Lane, fifty-two to sixty-five. Really? Um, Ro yeah, Night Train Lane. He has sixty-eight interceptions. I didn't um, know that. Rod Woodson uh, is number three, uh, seventy-one interceptions, eighty-seven to two thousand three. Number two, a little bit harder, Emlyn Tunnel. If you remember that name, yeah, yeah, he played in the he played from the 1948 to 1961, and he had uh, 79 career interceptions and number one overall. Played from 64 to 79, and it's Paul Krause with 81 yep, interceptions. Vikings, number 22 yeah. on the Vikings. Yeah, I would not yeah. have thought that. Wow, that was a tough one. That was tough, right? I'm I'm I, I'm not that surprised about. You not being able to get it, but uh, I thought maybe you would get a couple more. I thought you were going to get Nitrate Lane for some reason. Just I feel like he threw his name out a few times in the past with certain things. <laughs> um, I threw out Ken Houston. It got me nowhere. Yeah, yeah I was so. going to start throwing out. I was going to start throwing out odd names like Elvis Toast Patterson. 
<laughs> Spider Lockhart. Yeah, Spider's not too bad either. The other one who just missed, which I could not believe, and I thought for sure he was going to be in the top five, but at 21 was Daryl Green, who I just thought he would be top 20 because he I felt like he played for 20 years. But yeah, so that was my question. That, what's was, the cutoff that was pretty at, tough. What's the cutoff at 20? How many interceptions? Uh, 20, 20th is 55 career interceptions. Okay. Where, uh, if you had to guess kind of a bonus question, if you had to guess, uh, only because he's been in the news a lot this season for his, uh, college team, uh, where do you think Deion Sanders is and how many interceptions do you think he had career wise? You know, it's interesting. I didn't even think of him in this list and I should have, where does he rate on that list? Well, he's got to be outside the top 20. He's probably got about 35. A little bit higher. He's actually tied for 24th with 53. So wow. he's two away okay. from the top 20. But uh, same thing. I didn't – I never thought he would have been up I – did, I didn't think about him being on the list either, which is surprising considering all the talk he's uh, been talking about with the Hall of Fame and the special jacket for the elite players and everything. And I'm like, all right. I mean, he was a ridiculous athlete all around, but uh, I thought he had more interceptions than that. I actually love prime time. I love oh, I love time. him too. Okay, and well, that was a good the... list. Way to embarrass me on that. So, <laughs> <laughs> I told I you it was going to be a tough one. <laughs> Kraus, I remember from the Vikings. He was number twenty-two, but I, I, you know, obviously, I haven't thought about that name in like forty years. So, yeah, you know, that was a good. I think one. it's not. Right. I think it's nice to throw a little, uh, you know, uh, shine the highlight on the uh, defensive players every now and then. Given, like I said, the offensive output of the NFL the last few years. So. It's nice to hear some of these names again. I miss I'm surprised you didn't go sacks. Oh, wait, LT's not number one. All right, very good, man. Nice.